Hello everyone. Today I am going to explain one of the concept. So that is uses of inert gases. In this class, I am discussing about the some uses of inert gases. Now the uses of helium. Helium is the first element of eighth A group elements. Helium is non-inflammable and light gas. It is non-inflammable and very very light gas. Due to those reasons, it is used in filling balloons for meteorological observations. So, for doing the observations in meteorology, so helium is using for filling the balloons. That is the first use of helium. And next one, it is also used in gas cooled nuclear reactors that is also using in gas cooled nuclear reactors and next one liquid helium its boiling point is very very low that is uh, 4.2 kelvins finds use as cryogenic agent cryogenic agent means that makes very very low temperatures so that's why liquid helium that is using for making low temperatures in which some experiments the scientists are doing that is about the using of liquid helium as a cryogenic agent and next one it is used to produce and sustain powerful superconducting magnets it is using for the production of a powerful superconducting magnet. So these powerful superconducting magnets are so one of the important parts in NMR spectroscope spectrometers and magnetic resonance imaging systems. That means these powerful superconducting magnets are using in the NMR spectrometers and MRI systems, magnetic resonance imaging systems. And for the manufacturing of powerful superconducting magnets, helium is using. That is about one of the use of helium. And the next one, it is used as a diluent for oxygen in modern diving apparatus because it's very low solubility in blood. So due to its very low solubility in the blood, helium that is using as a diluent for oxygen in modern diving apparatus so these are the some of the uses of first element of ATA group elements that is helium now the uses of neon neon is used in discharge tubes and fluorescent bulbs for advertisement display purposes for the advertisement display purposes neon that is using in discharge tubes and fluorescent bulbs that is the one of the use of neon and next neon bulbs are used in botanical gardens and green houses so neon bulbs are using in the botanical gardens and in green houses also those are the some of the uses of neon and next element is the argon uses of argon it is used to provide an inert atmosphere in high temperature metallurgical processes so metallurgical processes that means extraction of the metals by using some chemical processes and also uh, physical processes that is about the metallurgy in metallurgical processes at a high temperature for providing the inert atmosphere the inert gas that is the argon is used that is one of the use of argon next one it is also used in filling electric bulbs electric bulbs are filling with one of the inert gas that is argon and next it is also used in laboratory in the laboratory for handling 
the substances that are air sensitive the substances which are air sensitive in the laboratory so argon is used for providing the inert atmosphere so these are about the uses of neon and argon and the next elements are xenon and krypton so there is no significant uses for the xenon and krypton so this is about the concept of uses of inert gases in the next class we will discuss about the another topic thank you